Let's give this a taste and see what it's like. What the f Hey guys, I'm Ryan and welcome to my kitchen. Super fun, big challenge coming at ya. I have been asked by my colleague Tom to recreate this avocado gelato from scratch. This concept first appeared in a Bring Me video that came out of BuzzFeed UK. There's three simple rules which I've been asked to follow. Make it from scratch, make it look the same, and make sure that it tastes great. Now, I think there's high stakes involved. Aussies love their avocados. If I don't get this right, every Australian on this planet is going to come for me. So, I'm gonna do you proud. So what I'm gonna do is watch this video, we're gonna break down the components and see how the recipe comes together. So the gelato is made by blending husk avocados with grape sugar and lemon juice. Wait, grape sugar? What the hell is grape sugar? It says that grape sugar is another term for glucose. So I'm guessing I just need to mix water and sugar together in order to create that. And that will be the sweetener for this. Okay, she's pouring it into a big gelato machine and out comes perfectly frozen, smooth and creamy gelato. Now I don't have a churner, so we're gonna do it all by hand. I am so excited to get this started, so let's get to it. To begin, we're going to make the sugar syrup using two cups of water, add it to a saucepan on medium heat, and then add one and a half cups of caster sugar. This will heat up nice and slowly. All you need to do is give it a gentle stir. What that will do is create a nice and thick syrup once it heats up. Next up, we are going to add the avocados to a blender. Separate four avocados down the spine, pop out the seed, and then you want to scoop out the flesh and add it to the blender jug. There we go. So that's four avocados completely added to a blender jug. What I'm gonna do is freeze the shells. Okay, next up we're going to add two lemons into the jug. I'm gonna teach you a little bit of a hack. I saw this online the other day. Pierce a hole in like the little nose of the lemon and then go to town and just squeeze it. So that's two lemons and four avocados in the jug. Now we just need to add those two cups of sugar. Add that lid on there and now we blend. I have just blended all the avocados and I have to say the mixture looks absolutely amazing. Add it to a brownie pan. Wow, look how smooth that is. I'm going to add it to the freezer for two hours and that's just to give it a bit of a preset before it sets in the avocado shell. To make the avocado seed, I am going to simply make bliss balls. I feel like they are dark brown, so they're going to look more like a real avocado seed. They're super simple to make and they are vegan. So winning. Add 15 days to a bowl, top with hot water and then allow to sit for 10 minutes. They've been sitting there for 10 minutes, so I'm going to drain them. So add the dates in, half a cup of rolled oats, half a cup of desiccated coconut, two tablespoons of coconut oil, two tablespoons of maple syrup, two tablespoons of cocoa powder. Now what you want to do is take a hand mixer and bring it all together until fully combined. Okay, that mixture is looking amazing. It smells really good. I need to make these like the size of an avocado seed. So I'm gonna go bigger than I normally would and I want them to be perfectly rounded. These are so easy to make. These can now go in the fridge and we can get back to the gelato. I cannot wait to eat this. What I'm going to do is scoop the gelato into the shells and then we're gonna smooth it off just like the woman did in the video. It's gonna get a little bit messy, but... I think that technique is kind of working. And then that can go back on the tray and we can fill all of them up. Okay, that's eight avocado shells on the tray. We're gonna get these straight in the freezer to set. So I just got these ones out of the freezer and I am shook. Look how amazing it is. Ah, it's so cold, I don't wanna hold it anymore. Ah, but I love the look of it. 
Next up, what I need to do is create that hole for the seed. I've got some hot water here. I have my tablespoon measure and I am going to scoop out that hole. I'd say that that looks perfect. Like that is a perfect hole. Here is my perfectly shaped avocado seed. And would you look at that? I am completely amazed. So let's give this a whirl. Look how delicious and creamy that is. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, this tastes like nothing you've ever had before. It's like avocado and steroids. If I can do this, you 100% can. Get some avocados, smash them in a blender, and make avo lato. Until next time, bye guys.